Richard from Beast Consultants. I'm in the office today and I'm with John Gilbertson. John works for Tablet PC. John, what does Tablet PC do? Oh, pa Tablet PC uh, uh, retails tablet PCs, not tablet Android, uh, but also they do a lot of teaching of how to use tablets, how to make use of the tool that's, uh, that a tablet is. Yeah. They use uh, surfaces as well? Oh, yeah, use surfaces, um, really any tablet, but uh, or tablet PC rather, but yep. um, they're specialising in Surface because it's so good. Yeah, it's one of the best products out there, isn't it? For sure. Mm. Today we want to have a look at Drawboard. Now, you've probably heard of Drawboard, it's part of the Microsoft suite. And if you've purchased a Surface 3 or 4 or a Surface Book, you get it free. If you haven't had a look at it, it is one of the best PDF readers that's on the market and it is the most used PDF reader in the whole Windows package. So let's have a look at it today. John, have you actually used Drawboard? Not a lot, but I've had a look at it, played around with it, and it's pretty good. Would you like to uh, have a bit of a look at how Drawboard actually works? I'm sure everybody else would too. Yes, thanks Richard. Be All good. right, well, on our page here, we've already just open Drawboard. Mm -hmm. Now, if you haven't got it on your, your computer, you can actually download it from the uh, the Windows Store. Not the iTunes Store, Windows. Windows, yeah. And uh, it costs a few dollars, but for what it is, it is actually very, very cheap, and it's a uh, very good value. Now, you will see here that uh, this is our opening page, and uh, it asks us straight off, open or create your first PDF. Now, so it invites us straight here just to open our first file. So I'm just gonna use my finger today because it's easier, and uh, takes us into a files we can open up any of the documents that we've already got a blank document straight off and uh, perhaps we might just do that today so we'll, we'll pick out a document we'll go to a a4 because that's a standard size we use it also gives us on our screen here a selection of different uh, colors so there's our white for paper and also uh, we can you know pick other colors but we can also do grid outlines and things like that over the top of our, our papers. So um, it, it's all built into it already. Mm -hmm. So we just create a document. It's the easiest thing to do. So now we're on our workspace. It's just a blank page. And we have a few basic tools that are already there. And we have this little lovely little green dot here. Our hockey puck as some people call it. But it's uh, like our control hub. Now on the side... On the right hand side there's already a, a selection of a few things there so there's a biro there that somebody's already picked and used pretty simple and the end of the if you turn the turn the pen over you can use it just to rub it out it's also got a rubber tool uh, rubber here and the tool selection now this little part the little radial actually gives us a selection of tools that we can use for doing different things now we're just in the basic level of uh, drawboard PDF and uh, we can use the pens you can select different colors and you can open up the colors and then you get even more so we've got a selection of over 40 colors that are available for us to use so whatever color you decide to pick that's what comes up you can change change our colors to you know, anything in the browns here whatever color you want to use and, pretty good uh, Richard very useful for sketching and marking things up so if you pretend this this was a document and a lot of writing on it you can actually use this to highlight a certain part of it you can um, you know write write your own little notes in the side fantastic straight over the top of any PDF whether that's a building plan whether it's documents whether it's paperwork all that sort of thing so for instance if uh, let's say you're an accountant sending out um, financial returns people can sign it then and there and send it back to you oh yeah it's exactly right so you could you know you probably want to pick black because that's the color that most people use for signing something accountants in red is not very good <laughs> <laughs> all right so yeah it's it's a this is pretty good so there's a lot of tools that are on here that you actually can't use at this level because once you ask for it it'll tell you to acquire the pro Okay. Now the pro in this is absolutely a fantastic tool. Mm -hmm. It it starts giving you all the measurement tools and the uh, different okay. tools for working out square areas and volume and all that sort of stuff already. Um, so that's that's a, that's very very valuable. Sorry, I went a bit too fast. But uh, what you can do on here and is uh, really 
they're a useful signature tool. Put a space, it'll ask you to do a signature, put a new signature, put your signature on the page, you can write your name in, put the company in, Wait. put your name in it, it'll go to save because now you filled it out, save that, and it saves it for you. So after you've done that, you can insert a, uh, a signature just in a box, pick the signature you want, insert it and there it is amazing that's pretty good that's pretty don't have to keep signing it over and over and over some do documents so yeah so there are a lot of other features on here we'll look at some of those a bit later on as i said in the pro level all of the functions are available on this and uh the other thing is because this is movable sometimes you, know, you might be using a full page on something because oh yeah it's the other thing you do blow it up but just use your fingers to to move things around it's really good there's a actually, lot of things I'd like to blow up, but <laughs> I, I see what you mean. You also get to be able to keep the document. It'll ask you if you want to save changes, if you've made changes. If you don't right. want to, you just get something and discard the changes, it's gone. Okay. That's where we're going to start with Drawboard. I hope you found it interesting. I Thank really you. did. Thank you. No worries, mate. Thanks very much for your time today. I'm Richard from Beast Consultants. You can contact me at beastconsultants.com.au or at beastconsultants.outlook.com. Thank you.